importing the CAD files into the 3D Studio Max. Hello my friends, my name is Mehdi Ashrafian. Before starting, subscribe our channel in YouTube and turn on the notification. In this case, we want to learn how we can import AutoCAD files into the 3D Studio Max. In AutoCAD, I want to open a file. I go to open and open a drawing. On the desktop, click on the My File. That its name is Plan. You can see our plan is here and its parts, different parts in different rooms, and some details. Uh, it is some important notes, we must uh, notice them. First, we have some details here, like flowers or furniture, that it can be used in the AutoCAD file. But in the 3D Studio Max, we don't need to these objects because these objects only can be used in the AutoCAD and we don't need to them in the uh, 3D Studio Max. So we can delete these objects uh, from our plan. And the second note is uh, the units. I want to check this unit file so that I type unit and click enter. We have this window drawing units here, and you can see our unit is centimeters. Uh, this is very important that uh, we use this file when uh, importing this file into the 3D Studio Max. We must use this unit in the 3D Studio Max. Okay, I click OK and I want to open this or import uh, this plan in the 3D Studio Max. I open the 3D Studio Max, go to File menu, Import and Import. On the desktop, click on my file that its name is Plan. We have this uh, window AutoCAD DWG DXF import options. In the Geometry tab, we have uh, an option uh, to name incoming file units that it is very, very important. Uh, we must uh, set this unit equal in the AutoCAD. If we use uh, in the AutoCAD uh, centimeter, this unit must be centimeter, or if we use the Another uh, unit like feet, meters, millimeters, kilometers, or so on, we must uh, set this parameter or set these options same to uh, in the AutoCAD. Okay, I check the rescale box and uh, check the uh, or choose this, this unit in this option. We have second option that drive AutoCAD primitively, primitives by. Uh, we can use some options here to importing the AutoCAD files that uh, these options that its name layer blocks as a node hierarchy split by material is uh, so good for more uh, importing files in uh, AutoCAD options. We have the layers panel here. If we want to choose some layers, we can uh, turn on the select from list and uh, choose uh, that layer we want. If we want to choose all layers, click all button. If we want to choose known, click known. And if we want to uh, set this uh, selection inverse, we can select the invert option. If we want to import all the layers um, that in the AutoCAD, uh, excluding the frozen layers, we can uh, select this option that its name skip all frozen layers. And we can 
uh, choose some options in the geometry option if we want to weld the vertex that uh, is nearby um, each other we can uh, check this box weld nearby vertex and uh, set the, its threshold that its um, measurement between the vertex and we can set it to uh, weld this uh, vertex and if we want to auto smooth the faces that we have uh, some 3d objects in the autocad that incoming into the 3d studio max file we can check this auto smooth option and set the angle between the polygons or faces in this here okay i want to turn off this checkbox and click ok so we have this file here i want to check it the most important note is that if you use the same unit uh, in the 3d studio max that uh, is equals in the autocad file our measurement is true if you choose another option your uh, measurement is uh, false we can check it I want to check uh, some of details here or some of measurement I zoom in this area I want to uh, measure this uh, wall here and check it if is uh, if it is true or is not true we can check some uh, measurement here I want to zoom in this area and some zoom out here if I go to my grid and snap setting options on the home grid options we can see our setting here is uh, set to 10 uh, so 10 multiplied 10 centimeters equals one meter I have this uh, squares here that its measurement is one meter in one meter so uh, we have this wall long uh, equals uh, one two three four five uh, about four point uh, five point five uh, meter here that uh, so is uh, this measurement true and uh, on the other parts of the building or plan our measurement uh, we can see is true so it's the uh, important notes about the uh, CAD files that we import into the 3d studio max if you like it subscribe our channel in YouTube and follow our page in Instagram thanks a lot see you in the next lesson